Hey guys and welcome to my review of Nobody. Uh, let's jump into it. I'm really excited. It's a new movie. I'm really excited to jump into it. So let's go, Mr. Nobody. Just Nobody. The movie's called Just Nobody. Uh, it is a fucking great action-packed movie of awesomeness. Great action. Great. Action. It's a fucking great movie. Also, we'll talk about some uh, surprise guest stars who made appearance in this movie. Who I didn't know was gonna be in this movie and was awesome and was great and was like, yes, please, I want more. That was just awesome and I wonder if I can see that. So great. So we go in. This this. So the movie was like I said, such great. The jump into the movie. They got the spoilers. But this guy who obviously has a day job and has a family and all this stuff, normal stuff, and he gets this thing and eventually somebody breaks into his house and he's like, he doesn't actually hurt the people and doesn't. And everybody's like. Why didn't he hurt him? Da, da, da. We find out eventually that's because the guns were empty, they didn't really have anything. So it's like he, they weren't really gonna do any real damage, they weren't gonna kill anybody. I don't know why you didn't say your guns were empty. Or do something like that. I would have been like, uh, your guns are empty. But I think that's one of the reasons why you didn't kill them, because you knew they weren't really there to kill or really hurt people. Or at least in that sense. But uh, they eventually got, they got out, they took some money and stuff, and he goes to, he gets that urge, and like, I need to go get them. Uh, get the kitty cat bracelet, so he goes for the kitty cat bracelet. But eventually you find out that the at his house, so he didn't really need to go. But he goes, gets his wash rack and stuff, and goes, and obviously he goes to them. He kind of left the one guy below, but he finds out they have a baby and all this stuff, and it's like, okay, you're doing it because you need to get money to help your kid and stuff, so he's just kind of like, okay, there's a reason they're doing it, they're not really bad people. It's like, I don't need another full situation. I let him go because of the reason they're doing it. And then eventually he like, goes to this bus and then these guys come on to complete dick watch. All come on the bus as they just got a car like, and then they get on the bus. And then he goes and attacks them and beats the shit out of them. Basically killing almost all of them. Uh, wounding them to almost near death. And while he's killing them, if not wounding all of them. I, the bunch of them are in the hospital so they all be wounded pretty much. But they're all like fucked up. He fucked them all up. He gets fucked up a lot as well. He goes home and shows that he's a fucked up guy. He does fucked up shit. And they even think that he's an auditor. He used to, the last, I'm the last person you would see when somebody needed to, you know, call a secret. I guess he left the gig and went to go get a family and stuff and all this thing. So yeah, eventually he, um, the guys, he attacked on the bus. One of them was actually a, uh, the, uh, he was the son to like the big, like Russian mob guy who was running everything. Gun stuff at a party stuff, so he actually went and goes after him and goes after him. You know, he didn't like his brother. He kind of was like, yeah, I don't like him, but he's still family. So I went, he went after him and they all go after him. And then he gets into a big fight with all of them, tells his family, like, he locks him in this thing, like, comes up and they even kind of find out about what he does and, like, whatever. And it goes on and it's great and it's, like, fun. And I'm like, yeah, I enjoy it. It was fun. They have a big action scene of him doing a bunch of cool action scenes in his house and they attack him and he's been down the house and he goes to another place and he goes and fights all of them and then you find out he wants his dad we find out his dad's in the nursing home you know his dad played by the set in the credits and I'm like wait he's in this movie? Christopher Lloyd yep from Emmett Brown himself Christopher Lloyd I was like what he's still he's in this movie for a thought of I'm like what I was totally surprised and I don't think any of the trailers showed him what was great, because that's a fucking surprise, if any, because I love Christopher Lloyd. And also this movie, he's a badass, he has a shotgun, he goes around shooting people, he just fucking up people, it's like an old man, he's just, and he's old too, and he still feels like Christopher, Christopher Lloyd, he's like, he still has that Christopher Lloyd, you know, mm, to him, I was like, yeah, you fucking, Christopher Lloyd's awesome, he's great in this movie, he's fucking great. So yeah, he was going on a shotgun, there's another guy he was talking to on the radio all the time. He's kind of like warning him and he comes in and he helps them fight and they all have a big fight at the end and get them all in. It's great. And yeah, there is, uh, yeah, it's great. Really enjoyed it, had a lot of fun with it. So yeah, what did you guys think of Miss, of Nobody? I'm, I always try to say Mr. Nobody, but just Nobody. Nobody, let me know in the comments down below, look at my rating. This one was really good, I want to put that... It's a 9 or 10. I think we gotta give it a 9. I don't think it's 10. It's really close though. It's really close. I'm it's 9. It's like, it's good. I would watch it again easily, but I'm gonna give it a 9. It's not 10. 10 are like favorites. And I think this one's close, but I think there's something about it that makes it slightly less favorite, but it's really good. It's like a 9. It's really good. Thank you guys for watching the video, and guys, see you next week, guys. Stay epic. And. Wait a minute.
Here's a man. Fire in the hole. Who's <coughs> 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 a fucking <laughs> oh, Hasta la vista, baby. <coughs> they think you've won. <coughs> That's more of us. We'll keep coming. <coughs> There's no left. <coughs> you think you can beat us? You haven't got shit, you mother- <laughs>